Hi, friends. I'm going to unbox and review a very interesting and useful product. The Crow Pi 3 from Elecro. First thing is micro bit. Here is our product, as you can see everything is mentioned on the box. This is Crow Pi 3 Advanced Kit. If you are interested to buy this, link is in the description, go and check out. So let's unbox and take a look. Inside the box there are some Minecraft blocks. a user manual. Everyone must read this before using the product. Wow, here is a cool wireless keyboard. Finally, here is our Crow PI3. Now let's see what is next in Advanced Kit. Here is some electronic components, jumper wires for breadboard, and base pins for Arduino Nano and Raspberry Pi Pico. Here is a magnetic emoji, a remote control, screwdriver, card reader, and a keychain. There are two SD cards. some tags, a crowtail hub, type C to C and a micro USB cable, a Raspberry Pi Pico, a servo motor, stepper motor, and a normal DC motor. Nice premium quality wireless mouse. There are two USB game controllers. A 5 volts 5 ampere power adapter for powering the Pico 3. Two one eight six five zero three three hundred thirty milliampere hour batteries for Pico three. Here you can read on the box everything is mentioned about what is in the Pico three point four three inch touchscreen with different sensors and breadboard. three USB ports and an Ethernet port. A handle on the top. Two Type-C ports, HDMI port, power button, volume up-down button, and an audio jack. Here is Raspberry Pi 5 16 gigabyte board and battery holder. Four point three inch flippable display. One hundred twenty eight gigabytes for system and thirty two gigabytes for games.
First, I'm going to test with 32 gigabyte SD card. You can run it on batteries. As you can see, there are different games for both single and multiplayers. You can also attach an extra screen via HDMI cable for enjoying on big screen. Now I am going to test with 128GB SD card. Inside the system, there are different programming platforms and games. For programming and coding, you can watch the tutorials on YouTube. I will also provide a video reference. You will find the link to this video in the description.